Let's solve one previous question of mathematical logic. This question was asked in GATE CS 2019, question number 35. Consider the first order predicate formula phi for all x, for all z, z divide x implies z equals to x or z equals to 1. Implies there exists a w, w greater than x and for all z, z divide w implies w equals to z or z equals to 1. Here a divide b denotes the a divide b where a and b are integers. Consider the following sets. Which of the above sets satisfy phi? And 4 options are given. So let me divide it into 3 part. First for all z, z divide x, z equals to x or z equals to 1. Let it be p. It means x is a prime number. Then there exists w, w greater than x. Which means there is another w, w is greater than x. Then this for all z, z divide w implies w equals to z or z equals to 1. Means w is also a prime number. So we can write it as p implies q and r. If this is p, this is q, this is r, then p implies q and r. In sentence, we can say if x is a prime number in this set, then there exists another prime number w in this set which is larger than x. Now let's check each set. Set 1, it contains 1 to 100. Now let's x equals to 97. Now what will be w? Above 97, next prime number is 1 not 1. Let w equals to 1 not 1. But it is out of 100, right? This set contains 1 to 100. This 101, one, it's greater than 100. So for x equals to 97, there is no w which is a prime number and which is in this set. So S1 doesn't satisfy phi. Even any finite set cannot satisfy phi. Now set 2, set of all positive integers. Yes, whatever value take for x, there is a w that is greater than x and that is a prime number. You can take infinite number, right? Next, S3 set of all integer. It contain both positive and negative number. So, whatever value take for x, there is another w which is prime and which is greater than x. So, S2 and S3 satisfy phi while S1 doesn't satisfy as it is finite. So, answer will be S2 and S3. It's present in option C. Answer will be option C. I already discussed mathematical logic, just go through the lecture and if this lecture is helpful for you, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.